Hey guys, it's the Soil Coffee and today and so this is Monster Analysis video. We're going to be going over Power Flow and Eternal Best and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not either of them is worth getting out of the current mini mazes or which one you should pick over the other. So let's just go ahead and get right into it. All right, so we are going to go ahead and start with the rolls. This monster of Hellflow is a support and Eternal Bastet is a denier. Personally, supports are definitely better just overall because you definitely need a support. You don't technically need a denier. So yeah, Hellflow does have that going for him. And then for the traits, Pelflow has Possession Immunity, Poison Immunity, and Team Stamina Regen. And then Eternal Bastet has Stun, Blind Immunity, and Self 50% Shield. So yeah, Pelflow is definitely better in that as well. This trait is kind of really bad on Eternal Bastet. Her relics are Staff and Mass Flow, which are both really good. And Pelflow has Staff and Amulet, which is also really good. So I do kind of think that those are kind of even. They're both pretty great relics. So now let's go on down to the moves. So Pelflow's moveset has an ally to Torture's removal with minor damage boost in an extra turn. That is a pretty great supporting move. And then he also has a team damage boost with stamina regen, which is pretty great. And then he has an ally double damage with 50% stamina restore, which is a really good move. And then he also has a team torture removal with 30% stamina restore. And he has a team 50% stamina restore with zero stamina, one cooldown. So yeah, that's pretty great as well. He has some pretty decent moves. He can't do any damage though, which is kind of interesting. But yeah, he has some great damage boost moves and stuff like that. And now let's go on down to Eternal Battle stats moves so she has a double stun with aoe earth weakness which can be good depending on what monsters you're using with her she also has a single target mega stun which is really good with light weakness and then she has an aoe stun and curse which is a pretty great move and then she has a sandstorm curse and team dark protection so she actually has some pretty good moves as well but she does only have stun for denial so if they are immune to stun you're just kind of done you can't really do anything and yeah she does have high stamina cost 52 58 63 yeah those are some really high stamina costs but yeah besides that decent moves and yeah power flow has really good cooldown and stamina cost actually even as the zero stamina one cooldown move and he does have ways to get stamina back, which is really good. So yeah, I do think that Pelflow is overall better, but Eternal Bastet is not a bad pick either. If you need a support, definitely get Pelflow. But if you really, really, really need a denier, I guess get Eternal Bastet. But there are definitely better options. So yeah, I would probably go for Pelflow no matter what inside of these mini mazes. Yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think of Pelflow and Eternal Bastet. And I'll see you guys in the next one over to like and subscribe. Goodbye.